Hello everybody, uh, my name is Wolfgang and I'm from first page of Google uh, dot com that's first page of hyphen google dot com and I'm making this video for an article I've just written about what Google wants now um, the reason this has come about has been that over the last two two years but particularly more recently over the last uh, 12 months or so Google have made many many changes to their algorithm and the reason they've done it is because they're not getting very good results when in other words when people type in uh, a search term they're not always getting exactly what they want and the reason for that is that there's a lot of spammy websites out there there's no other way to to describe it that are falsely on the first page of Google for for spam tactics and uh, that includes buying links um, back to their site from other sites paying for them um, blog networks that are all exchanging links things like that and also mainly because of, of article spinning what article spinning is it's it's writing one article putting it through a what they call an article spinner and you can have a thousand articles uh, based on that one article the problem with that is that they never read English or very rarely read English and then they distribute that to uh, hundreds of article directories and that's how they've built these links so Google's not happy with that so they are in de-indexing a lot of websites at the moment so the question is what does Google want well the first thing they want from you as a business owner is they want to be able to read your website properly to be able to know what the website's about uh, and that helps them to decide whereabouts they're going to place you in the search results so it's very very important that your website is very very well optimized now <clears throat> I'm going to show you my own report here for first page of google.com but all you do if you go into aboutus.org that's all you can see the title there aboutus.org um, they crawl your website in exactly the same way as Google does so it'll give you an idea of what Google sees when they go on your website um, because it's not just writing they don't bother looking at writing they look at the HTML and stuff like that anyway <clears throat> here's my my own home page and this is so click on those links gives us a little more and you see the titles and headings is good everything's fine on there but let me show you about about that so the title of the web page uh, which is the first thing that Google will look at uh, or the title of the home address on in this case but it would be the same if it was um, an article that you'd written is uh, first page of Google local marketing online help for local business so Google can see exactly what this site is about um, so it's not just a matter of getting it the right length this is the right length uh, around about 70 70 characters it's about putting good information into it as well which unfortunately this site report from about us doesn't really know the information is it will tell you yes it's good if it's got Tom Jones uh, lives in uh, or Rocca Nevada or, or something like that in there it would still tell you it's good but it isn't it needs a really good description in there the next thing well the title actually is the, the, the blue line that you get in the search results across the top the next is a meta description now this is a description that goes below the blue line so let me show you here the meta description is is good on on this particular site between 50 and 150 characters personally I would go for more like 140 characters because Google is now starting to put the date in just a minute I'm going to stop the video for a second so I'm sorry about that my dog starts barking she's she's terrible she barks a lot anyway the meta description is also very important this this is what entices people to click on the blue link above 
the meta description for this home page is first page of Google local marketing online help for local business is for local business owners who want to be on the first page of Google then we have the h1 heading which is the second most important place that Google looks and the h1 heading for this site is first page of Google local marketing so straight away they know exactly what the site's about and then this report will give you um, a preview on what your site's going to look like in the search results and you can see there there's the blue title and there's the meta description so that's one and then we've got number two links and images let's have a look at that and it's important to have links going out of your site as well as coming into your site and that shows Google that you have confidence and people elsewhere on the web uh, with where there's good information um, it's also important if you have any images photos etc that they have a an alt text I'll show you that uh, you can click on that or oh, sorry I clicked the wrong one alt text no it's telling me it's telling me what alt text is which is all right but if you click on where is it gone now click on this link and it will tell you more so you can do that all the images on this site have got an alt text which in other words tells Google what the image is about because they can't see photos, uh, but they can read descriptions search engine friendliness this is another important part of the site good this website's text file is not blocking the major search engines from crawling its pages your website can appear in any search engine results canonical URL what a canonical URL is the, the website can li live at www.website address or the website address without the www. And it's usually better to redirect the one that's without the www. to the one that is www. So your website lives at just one URL. Um, and that, that again is correct in my case. I can take this further with web presence if we want to. Um, I, I won't. I won't go into all this refresh it, but you see that I actually have fifteen thousand nine hundred pages indexed, and now there isn't that number of pages on this site. But where it's come from is there's an auto trans translate on there that translates into several different languages, uh, but all those pages have been indexed. And we got backlink authority uh, 62. That's the number of sites, other sites that are actually linking to me. Um, as far as the links actually go, there's around around about um, what four four five thousand links pointing back to the first page of Google. I hope you found that interesting. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how a good site will uh, actually. Um, how it should work together with your Google listing, together with your videos, and together with the images. Everything should work together. So I'm going to go into here and I'm going to type google.com to show you that this is actually a worldwide search that I'm going to perform here. And if I type, click on here, that brings up google.com. So if I type in here, I'm going to use my main keywords for this. It's not the title, well, it's part of the title of the site, but these are my main keywords online help for local business. Sorry for talking. We'll click that because I'd made a mistake there with the spelling. And we we'll click this to get rid of my own results just to show you what I'm showing you. And you see there, that's that's got a around about one billion eight hundred and seventy million competitors for that particular turn. And there I am, I'm number one there. Um, and then we've got below that, so we've got number one, two, three, and position number four, and number five for video. Um, so that's not bad really but let's have a look at images let's see where we come with images you see there's my ugly mug if we go on videos 
where do we appear on videos where again these are paid for ads at the top here then we've got mine wolfie worldwide wolfie worldwide wolfie worldwide wolfie worldwide for five i've got five to ten results in there this is the one that you're going to be interested in if i go into maps bearing in mind this is a worldwide search not a local search you'll find that i'm not in twickenham in england and there it is and you see there it's giving my listed number two we're in spain and here's that in tenerife and you see there's 429,000 results of businesses using that particular phrase so if i click on that link there you'll find that it is a worldwide result um, so again i'm number one and number two number three into it mountain way ca i don't know whether that, that's in uh, america anyway then we've got help my local business swanson in swansea united kingdoms uh, leicestershire united kingdom south wales united kingdom we've got quite a few in the night united kingdom here cambridge uh shepparton road Pensoka Township, New Jersey, that's America. Ask PA your better future, uh, that's in the UK. Online support, United Kingdom. Uh, but that's it, sometimes you get Australia, New Zealand, and things like that pop up. But you can see it is a worldwide search. So that's how search engine optimization should work, and it should also help to get you more customers. Thank you for taking the time for watching this video. Sorry about the dog barking. If you did like it, please click the like button below. It all helps with my rankings. And if you want to subscribe to my channel, please click the subscribe button above and you will get um, automatic updates. Whenever I make a new video, you will, you will get them. Thank you for taking your time. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.